Good day, good day! <laughs> How the honk are you? Welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dano, and have I got something for you today on a one of Wednesday? Yeah! Oh my goodness, look at this bad boy. <laughs> this is my one and only of this uh, new bright Land Rover LR3. Um, we are going to try to take a look at this. We're <laughs> excuse the junk in the background. I'm trying to set up for this big, huge uh, thing, but this is just unbelievable. I'm finally got enough room in the studio here in the in the uh, Roverland shop to uh, kind of set up and take a look at this. So, this is, ladies and gentlemen, the new bright RC vehicle, the Land Rover R3 LR3. Now, um, wow, I got this thing, I don't remember when, but the date on the bottom is 2006. Uh, I got this, I believe, at uh, uh, Wally World, Walmart, uh, from the store. This is one I purchased from the store. This thing is huge. And uh, huge it is. I do not have... Um, I do not have a regular yardstick, but we're just going to take a measurement. I'm going to step here in front of the, the camera here a little bit. This box is 32, 32 inches uh, wide. I suppose I could do it this way. So then the numbers are kind of uh, the right way. <laughs> 32 by, uh, this is probably going to be like, uh, what is that? 20 inches, about 20, 19, 20 inches tall. So this is a huge model. Uh, we're going to turn it on its side here shortly. But uh, yeah, so I've had this for a while, like I said, uh, since 2006. Um, very, very cool. Says that it's hobby grade here. Um, very, very cool hobby grade uh, four-wheel force. You can go on YouTube right now and check out some videos um, of uh, this particular model uh, just this last year. So I don't know if you can still buy this um, currently from New Bright. I, I don't think so, but uh, yeah, check it out. There's a Google it, you can find out. But right now, let's take a look a little bit more about this in the box. Now, I have never, um, I'm not taking this out of the box. <laughs> I bought it in a box. It's never been out of the box uh, from 2006. So, yeah, this is going to stay in there. I, I got some uh, some contractors sprayed some exhaust, uh, foam, uh, expanding foam on the, the darn thing and kind of got the, uh, here's the side of it. Kind of zoom in here so you kind of see some of the details here. Um, very, very cool. Uh, some of the ones that I saw on the um, on YouTube uh, didn't have these uh, little knobs on top uh, and different style of wheels. They were more um, uh, road wheels. These are kind of more like a tractor type wheel, but uh, very interesting, very uh, cool. A um, lot of neat things to uh, to see here. Um, dual, what is that? Dual. Microplex 351 motors. Yeah, check that out, huh? And uh, four-wheel drive, four-wheel suspension. There is the nylon reinforced gears, frequency switches. So if you got more than one truck going at a time, you can uh, uh, have that, you know, so you don't uh, have problems with uh, running several trucks at the same time. That's what it is. <laughs> so that's the one side. Let's turn it back to the back here and see what we've got back there. Now, this is just huge. This is huge. This is awesome. This sits on the floor uh, of my, uh, of Roverland, underneath the, the, the wall of my collection. Uh, it's just so big, but uh, you can see a really a lot of cool stuff um, in, in this whole thing. Let's see if we can get uh, some panning going on here. But uh, really, really kind of cool. Um, I did see on um, the website that you can get more um, batteries from New Bright and stuff like that. But uh, 
yeah just just awesome just awesome uh look at the battery packs there and everything just cool 30 30 percent grade uh there that's uh all the four-wheel direction drive pretty cool you can see the controller there that's that's pretty cool uh never been <laughs> never been out of the box yeah i've been tempted a couple of times no not really but anyway this is just awesome just awesome all right so that's the back uh i'm just gonna quickly uh flash the uh bottom to you and so you kind of see what's going on there but uh, other than that we're gonna go right to the uh right to the other side see this is just just plain bottom it does say uh 2006 over there but uh and this is just kind of the, the mirrored uh mirrored uh from the other side so nothing new information there just uh really cool uh goes into a lot of the different uh stuff there but yeah there it is now um they they make a couple of different uh, sizes of these, and uh, I believe this is the other one that they do. Now this one is uh, more like uh, one tenth scale, and this one uh, is like one sixth sixth scale. You know what? Try to say that fast twice, really quick, huh? One sixth scale, and uh, kind of like uh, GI GI Joe size. So I've done a, a video, I think, on these, because I just bought this not too long ago off of eBay. But it's the same body style. It is just a different, different, uh, different size, of course. So, yeah, really kind of cool. Do you got one of these? This is the largest toy that I have of a Land Rover. This is, uh, and kind of one of my pride and joys of the collection. Uh, really, really kind of cool. Uh, I would like to uh, get another one, and so maybe that's uh, out of the package, uh, so I could, uh, you know, <laughs> play with it, <laughs> and uh, eventually, uh, you know, someday, um, you know, do some uh, photo shooting with it, you know. Uh, but I need a, uh, you know, whole other set of camera crew and and uh equipment to uh, be able to shoot footage of this thing on the road i need an operator of the camera or the operator of the uh vehicle so then uh you know we can put together a, a good vehicle and of course need a camera or a computer to uh edit the footage that we've got so this is uh just awesome I, I really like this piece uh new bright I, do, I believe as i saw on the uh website they are they do not have the uh land rover licensing anymore they they used to they've made uh quite a few um uh rc models that were land rover um related most mostly uh the lr3 discovery and they did do an lr uh two the uh uh, kind of like the little Freelander. Um, so yeah, just really kind of cool. Uh, if you've got one of these, hey, first off, if you like this kind of content, give me a thumbs up. Go ahead and subscribe. Uh, if you have one of these, uh, comment down below, will you? Uh, come on over to Facebook. I always point over there. Come on over to Facebook and uh, drop your picture of your car. We'll get quite a few people that can... Uh, post uh things on facebook uh roverland is the facebook page or uh instagram uh roverland channel that's i always point over there for roverland channel but anyway this is awesome uh do you have one have you had one uh yeah tell me your story i would like to hear about your story uh if you don't have this size how about this other size you got this other size um I did see uh, this one came in uh, a silver as well. Uh, later on, they did a uh, G4 version, and uh, that would be kind of cool to have. Uh, I don't think it came in this big, huge size, but uh, that would be awesome to have. All right, that's it. This is your friend Dan. Oh, I got to go. Uh, thank you for joining me for your one-of Wednesday jumbo size. Yeah, RC jumbo size. And as always, 
Remember, if you are seeing or not, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rover day.